competitive equilibrium of max utility functions apologies in advance if my terms aren't exact i'm learning mathematical economics in the hebrew language and some of the terms don't translate well i was given the following question Two sellers are a part of an exchange market with two goods. Each has the utility function dollar u x y equals max x y dollar. Assume the first seller starts with two units of product dollar x dollar and one unit of dollar y dollar. Find dollar a b dollar s t seller two starts with dollar a dollar units of dollar x dollar and dollar b dollar units of dollar y dollar, for which there is a competitive equilibrium. Any guidance will be of great help. Thanks in advance. I might be wrong so feel free to point out any mistakes, both of them have the same utility function $u x y equals max x y dollar this means when dollar px pi dollar, they'll choose to consume dollar y dollar instead of dollar x dollar since they get higher satisfaction by selling all units of x and purchasing y, take the case of first seller, if he sells all x and purchases y, his total demand for dollar y dollar will be $2 px pi plus $1 and since px pi greater than 1, total demand will be higher than 3. If he had done the opposite, his total demand will be less than 3, since the utility function is dollar max x, y dollar he will choose the former strategy hence, the demand for dollar x dollar will be 0 but the supply is dollar a plus 2 dollars. Also, there is excess demand of dollar y dollar. Hence, this is not a competitive equilibrium. Similarly, then dollar $px the only case we have left is dollar $px equals pi dollar where the seller will be indifferent in consuming either good. Here, each seller consumes all of one good each. There will be two cases, case 1. If seller 1 consumes all dollar $x dollar, his demand is $2 plus 1 pi $px equals $3 since $px equals pi and the supply of $x is dollar $a plus $2. When we equate this, we get dollar dollar a equals one dollar dollar. Notice that this is the only condition that needs to hold here. B can take any non-negative values in this case. Case two is where seller one consumes all dollar y dollar and his demand is one dollar plus two px pi equals three dollars and the supply of dollar y dollar is dollar b plus one dollar. Since they have to be equal, we get dollar dollar b equals two dollars dollar and again there's no restriction on dollar a dollar and it can take any non-negative values.